Hello, everyone. How are you? Welcome to Rimini. So, let's start. Um, first of all, I'd like to I'd like to welcome all the new Europython listeners. I know that we have a lot of regulars coming back to Europython every single year, which is great as well, of course. But uh, of course, we we always like to have new people come to the community, and then sorry, it's not working. Okay, so we always like to welcome new people to the community. And I, uh, I think it's, it's very nice that we always get new people to the conference. I also would like to welcome the sponsors, because without the sponsors, you'd be paying at least 200 euros more per ticket. So I think they deserve a, a good hand from you. So who's behind all this? It's a small team of volunteers. We are about 10 people who are really working hard to make this happen. And uh, of those 10 people, we have two people here up on the stage. Actually, we have more. We have three. <laughs> this is Christian. He's the chair of the conference. Buongiorno. So let's talk a little bit about the uh, EuroPython Society, so it's the non-profit organization behind the EuroPython. Uh, it's, it's quite old, from 2004. Uh, it runs EuroPython, and it supports the EuroPython community. And yes, as you can read, we are all volunteers, and we do this mostly just for fun. Right, so here's a small uh, slide with the, with the basic details that you need to know about your Python. So one thing, hello? Hello? It's working? No, it's not working. <laughs> Someone hit some button. Hello? Okay, so I have to shout. <laughs> so um, these are the, the basic details. So you have uh, the Wi-Fi, Europe Python 2017, both as SSID and as password. Uh, we have a conference app in the app store, so you can download. It has the schedule. We update it regularly, and we use it to push notifications to you to update you. Uh, we have a, a standard hashtag that we use for social channels, which is uh, hash Europe Python. Uh, we have a Telegram group, a public one. Uh, that you can search on Telegram and then you can participate there. So we have lots and lots of people there helping each other, which is very nice. And for everything else that you want to know, we have the conference desk. Okay, and you also have a very nice bag. Uh, what do you have inside the bag? You have the booklet of the conference, you have some coupons from the sponsors, uh, a very nice shirt, a super made in Italy bottle, and some gadgets from the sponsors. And you can find a lot of things inside the booklet. OK, so this is, um, this is a map of the venue. So we have two floors in this venue. We have an upper floor with the keynote room, which is this one. Uh, next door, we have a second room, which is just as large as this one. We're using that for talks. Um, on the ground floor, we have a few more rooms to the, if you go around the um, the corridor, if you go to the, to the right, we have the PyCharm room, we have the Python Anywhere room, and we have the room Arco, which is reserved for open space. On the left side, you have the training rooms, Tempio 1 and Tempio 2. And uh, in the middle, right in the middle, you have this large um, room called Piazza, and this is where we have all the sponsor booths. Ooh, catering. So, we have two coffee breaks. And we have the lunch, and yeah, it's Italian food. Also, you can see the water dispensers all around the venue, and please use your bottle. And this year, we don't have breakfast. Oh, sorry. Right, so of course you want to know what talks are on and when, and if there are any changes. So for that, we have, uh, like I said, the conference app. We also have the website. Um, there is going to be a conference info system. I don't know whether it's working yet. Um, plus, of course, we have the booklet. About the booklet, 
uh, I must say that we had a, quite a few changes in the program. So the booklet was printed uh, three weeks ago, just like the display that you see downstairs. So the booklet schedule, unfortunately, is not really up to date. So it's always good to have a look in the conference app and uh, to check for any changes. Okay, so we need help to, to run the conference. So we need ses session chairs. So please uh, look for the organizer or for the volunteer to, to join for this. Yeah, you can go up on the website. On the website, there's on the registration volunteer, there's a link to the volunteer app and you can sign up there. So we definitely need a few more session chairs to make everything happen. We are not enough people. Like I said in the beginning, just 10 people is just not enough to run a conference like this. Um, we have, we have uh, six keynoters, and uh, we have five keynotes in total, so one each day. And the first keynote is going to be Armin today, just right after this opening session. And we also have a lot of trainings. Uh, we have two rooms for the trainings. Uh, they are Tempu 1 and Tempu 2. And yeah, uh, we have a limited number of seats, so please go there as soon as you can. Right, and then we have uh, a whole set of other events waiting for you. So we have a lot of PyData sessions uh, scheduled. Uh, we have a recruitment session on Tuesday, so in case you're looking for a new job, a Python job, then uh, please go to the recruiting session and you'll have uh, companies there um, who are looking for people like you and uh, they would love to talk to you. Uh, we also have a, a poster session. Uh, you can find that in the, in the sponsor room, in the large one. We have open space, so if you want to run a talk that's not scheduled, then you can just go to the open space whiteboard and uh, put up a, a post-it and suggest a talk and then just uh, take that slot and do whatever you like with that slot. Uh, we also have a number of help desks. Help desk is something like the word uh, basically says. You can you get help from experts. And experts are usually people who run certain like open source uh, uh, projects and then you can just go there and they will help you directly with your problems. And of course we have the sprints after the conference, uh, but we're gonna talk about more that, about that later. So, um, back to the open spaces, so they are self-organized, um, low of two feet. You can find this on Wikipedia. Um, we will have a schedule available near the conference desk. There will be a big whiteboard for this. And we have several rooms all around the van. Then, of course, we have the lightning talks. Uh, lightning talks, if you don't know, are uh, very short talks, five-minute talks. Uh, you sign up on a flip, board, uh, a flip chart that we are going to put uh, downstairs next to the conference display. Uh, it's first come, first serve, so uh, if we, when we set up the board, you have to go there quite quickly to reserve your spot, and then you put up the title, the name of, uh, well, your name, uh, and then we're going to use that to call you up when the Lightning Talk uh, session starts. And you can do pretty much anything in the lightning talk session. It's just five minutes. It's, it's usually, it's, it's good if it's funny. It's, uh, it should be helpful. It should be informative. You should not use it for presenting your company. Okay, social event. Uh, we will have a social event this Thursday. Um, it will be around seven. Uh, the place will be the Coconuts. It's a club uh, near the beach. You can buy the ticket online and you can get the ticket at the registration desk. We have something new this year. Uh, it's called a quiet room. So if you want to just chill out a bit and maybe not use your computer for a short while, uh, then you can go to the quiet room. It's upstairs uh, on the first floor in the room Ponte, it's called. And you can go there. Um, just to relax. Uh, it's going to be there. There are some rules set up in that room. You can have a look at those. So basically, it just means that you shouldn't, you shouldn't really talk. You shouldn't discuss anything. Just sit there and maybe work or relax. Restore energy. Conference app. You can find the program on the conference app. You can find the application on the Apple market and on the, also for the Android phones. Um, it's not connected with the um, website, so you cannot have the same account. Uh, you will find the maps, the programs, as I said, and also a lot of useful information. 
So yesterday we already had the beginners workshop, which was very, very popular. And the, uh, the mentors there, they, uh, they want to basically share this idea of helping other people and make it possible for all the attendees to basically say, okay, I can help others who may, may have a question. Uh, so what they did is they created these stickers, as you can see here. You can get those stickers done at the conference desk. Um, and if you wear the sticker, it basically says that you're open to accept any questions from anyone. And then if you want help from someone, you can just approach these people and just ask them questions. So I think it's a very nice idea. Volunteers, uh, yellow t-shirt. So yeah, we are here to help. You can find volunteers inside the rooms, uh, close to the registration desk. And please, we need help uh, for a lot of stuff. So join the volunteers. And uh, with this slide, I'd also like to thank all the volunteers that have helped yesterday set up the conference. Uh, we had quite a few people, and it was really, really nice to see that people were open to help. And I think they need a big, big hand from you. Right, then we, we have a code of conduct. Essentially, it's uh, be nice to each other and be professional and please don't spam. Um, this applies to everything that we do at the conference, including all the social channels. So all the communication that happens at the conference and uh, related to the conference is under this uh, code of conduct. If you have any problems uh, that you see or you, you don't feel well uh, in, in, your, in your setting or something happened that you want to talk about, then you should contact our COC team which is these two fine ladies, including myself. So just so, just so you get some faces. Okay, speakers, so please contact the session chair of your room and of your session. Please be there on time. Um, please also try your notebook with, uh, with our system, with the system of the venue. I'm sorry if you have the new MacBook, probably it will not work. Uh, we will try to, I don't know, resolve this problem. Uh, we also have some new adapters for this, but uh, at least for now we are not very lucky. Um, so, uh, make sure to be there at least 10 minutes before the beginning of your session. And after the talk, uh, remember to leave the adapter there. And also, please, uh, if you can, upload your slides on the website. All right, we're almost done. There's one more thing that we have to say that uh, it's not allowed to have food or drinks in the session rooms, except your bottles. You, so you can take your bottles uh, into the rooms and then have, like, drink water. Um, we'd appreciate if you follow this because it just keeps the rooms clean and we don't have uh, that much issues with the venue then. So there's nothing much left to say, just except maybe enjoy the conference. And, uh,